The Lothalmond Trossachs National Park is right on the doorstep of Glasgow in the, the central belt of Scotland and it's a, a great playground for people who want to get out and, and enjoy the mountains. Ben Vane sits right at the at the heart of that with the as part of the Arica Alps, one of those kind of iconic places for people to get out and enjoy. Lots of people come out from Glasgow and have done for, for generations, right from the industrial time when they were encouraged to get out for uh, health and well-being to today when people come from far and wide to enjoy it on foot or by bike or even by horse. Volunteering is a key part of uh, maintaining and repairing passports, giving people the opportunity to, to come out and give something back. Quite often people who, who come out uh, during the week and, and enjoy the, the path recreationally will choose to come out and help us at the weekend to repair some of those paths that really are special to them. I'm working today, uh, volunteering today with Mountains and the People. What motivates me was probably because I do a lot of hill walking myself and I love coming to these wild open spaces and I see paths like this and I walk up here and I think gosh we're somebody do something about that so now I've got an opportunity to do something about it myself and I just love being out here and being with these guys and girls and uh, having a good day out on the hills. I enjoy uh, physical work and I love getting outdoors into the countryside and I love being on the hills. A path in a poor condition can take away from a, a nice day in the hills and it's uh, it's essential to, to, to maintain our, our, our mountain footpaths. It's easy to get to, the transport links are good, there's a visitor's car park at the bottom of the hill. You're only 40 minutes away from Glasgow from the hustle and bustle and you come out here and it's deadly silent. The footpath on Bedvane at the moment hasn't had any form of path management on it. Well, the route has been established for many, many years and it's now getting to the point where it really needs to have something done to it. The path design, the way it's been, it will be, it's predominantly stone pitch because of the steepness and, the, and the, the gradient of the path. Make it manageable and make it sustainable for the long term, that's the main aim. Hill walking is, is very, very popular and it's becoming more popular over the years. I've, I've been doing this job for a number of years now and I've seen how it's, it's progressed in popularity with people. There's more and more people coming on the hill, there's more and more footfall coming on the hill. That creates erosion and for people to give a little bit back, it's essential and it's very well welcomed.